In North Palm Beach, several pockets of the town still working through cleaning up from Saturday's tornado. WPTV News Channel 5's Matt Sesney checked in with some on how and when they'll be able to put this storm behind them. It's been days since the tornado and the cleanup still continues. Here at Sandalwood, these condos apparently were right in the path of that twister. I think I had 25 uh, blowers and uh, four dehumidifiers in there wow. since uh, Monday. The water damage was so bad in Gail McCormick's condo, it took two days to dry it out. We did take off the baseboard mm -hmm. and the crown molding, so on and so forth, and some of the ceilings yeah. because it was flooding down the stairs and I could not stop it myself. Elsewhere in North Palm Beach, aquarium shop owner Andy Finlayson had the storm crash through his front door, causing thousands of dollars of damage. Even pieces of the roof across PGA Boulevard were embedded in his fence. Something came through the window, ceiling uh, tile from across the street. It looked like it busted the front glass right out. His shop remains open as he relies on insurance to handle the damage. And for Gail, she's also relying on insurance while remaining in her home. I'm emotional. I'm emotional. You see a big tree coming towards you like that, and you go, this is it. Insurance adjusters have been here. In fact, we did see them here today talking with condo owners who also tell us they think it will be weeks before things here get back to normal. In North Palm Beach, Matt Sesney, WPTV, News Channel 5.